the basic things you need to look at if you're trying to get your first investment property is is really find out the what you're looking to get out of an investment property, your why. So if you can find out your why and uh, what's the reason behind you getting an investment property. Is it to replace income or is it to build wealth? So if you're looking if you're looking to build wealth and, uh, and not necessarily replace income, you could be looking at one asset class versus if you're looking to build cash flow and replace income, you might be looking at a, a separate one or you might find something in the middle. So getting an idea of why you're looking for an investment property will kind of help gauge which path you're gonna go down. So secondly, what I'd say is location. I mean, don't reinvent the wheel, location, location, location. They say it and it means a lot. And especially when you've had a lot of rental properties, you realize how important it is. And that's where your appreciation comes in. So really having an idea of the area of town that would make sense for you. So that kind of leads into the third thing, which should be demographic. You know, do you want to rent to college students? Do you want to rent to traditional families? What's your professors? You know, there's so many different demographics that you could rent to, all of which are different types of properties, different areas that could help add some diversity in a portfolio. So I think, you know, first things first, figure out your why. Second thing, figure out your location. So um, if you're looking for location base, you know, you're going to have a lot more appreciation in certain areas than, than others, but you have might have more cash flow in, in other areas than the ones with the highest and best use location. Um, third thing, um, I'd really say size, shape, and price. You know, what's kind of your buying criteria? A lot of people like, you know, 50, 100,000, 100, you know, it's hard to find those now, $150,000 houses. And then others are like, hey, I like, $350,000, $400,000 professor ready, you know, property. So once you have an idea of your, of, of your why, your demographic, your location, then you kind of pick your size and shape, you know, what ultimately, what kind of capital that can you put down and you can, you know, kind of gear in those ways and set up some filters so you can find the right, right property.